this thing working? Yeah, I think that's all right. <clears throat> in a world far, far, but not so far away, in the corner of one universe, there lived a guy and a girl who together were an awesome guy and a girl. For almost 17 years of their lives, they had gone without ever crossing paths, despite living within a minute of each other. Until one week in December of 2015, they crossed paths. Little did they know that this encounter could be the start of something new. Hashtag High School Musical Reference. Let's go. Now this is a story all about how their lives got flipped and turned upside down So I'd like to take a minute or maybe ten to tell the tale of Elijah M. Wren Here we have a banana, oh sorry, I mean Abanaza Played by the greatest actor of all time, you guessed it, Elijah Rose And here we have personified awesomeness, I mean sorry, Renee Lorraine one of the coolest YouTubers ever. Their awesome source journey started in the depths of hell. You guessed it yet? A college, specifically City and Islington Sixth Form College, where this awesome guy played Abanaza in the college production of Aladdin, while this awesome girl was a part of the props team and made sure he had some of his important props, such as his trusty rucksack, and of course, made sure he didn't lose his voice. It was her duty to ensure that he drank water and saved his voice. After this weird and wonderful week of Aladdin, Elijah and Renee's levels of awesomeness continued to rise over time. But it was one key conversation that revealed one of many interests that the two had shared. It was one winter afternoon that Renee sat on the infamous 73 bus and looked up to find an out of breath Elijah who exclaimed of course it's you before sitting opposite. It was amongst this conversation that the two had begun to talk of aspirations and dreams until Elijah had asked one of the most important questions of their friendship. Maybe it isn't that important but in hindsight it is so let me tell my story okay. <clears throat> He asked, what is one of your favourite TV shows? To which the girl thought and thought and eventually said, Doctor Who. I don't know where I am. There's a thing, this message, it's all around the world. If you click it on the Wi-Fi button, you will die. I'm a time troll. Well, I was, I'm, I'm stuck. Now, I know what you're thinking, what's the big deal about Doctor Who? Now you see, Doctor Who for starters, is the best show ever, and Elijah and Renee are both people who see that and embrace their Whovianness. Now, apart from this, over the course of the last 436 days, the two slowly found much more in common and in turn realised they were destined to be best friends. In their time together, the two had watched six episodes of Class, watched three Star Trek movies, <laughs> had two trips to the cinema, that one of which was the IMAX. Over 100 bus journeys shared, thousands of hugs shared, and trust me, I don't even doubt that number. Never ending doorstop conversations. I walked through all that. So, what are you doing? Put your phone down. Put it down now. Put it down.
I'm sick and I came to Elijah's house and he made me tea. Oh my god. Romeo and Juliet starred window talk. Hey! Hey you! One awesome outfit match. What, what, what are you doing? Enough! Enough! Put it down! Put it down! Three trips to Franco Manca. No, you can't. That girl, Wednesday. Don't tell me why I kind of cannot she can't, she cannot film this. It's so annoying. Two large pizzas ordered. Five parties gone to together. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Uncle, look what I'm with. Look at what? It, it's Elijah, by the way. What? You know? Oh, oh that lighting duck. Trying to get birth. Looking all cool like crap. Just like a just come from Beaver Dam. Trying to get birth. Looking all cool like crap. Just like a just come from Beaver Dam. Trying to get birth. Looking all cool like crap. Just like a just come from Beaver Better do your research. You don't want to hear my verse. Come after your verse. MC's like brand new. Hey, 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 Back at it again with mad cooking oh skills. My, oh my God. One birthday celebrated together. I like it so much. Yes, I'm gonna ride it up. It's a birthday. I wanna ride my like it so much. One Christmas partially together. A purple unicorn encounter. My team looks like that. What are you doing? Say hi. Hi. Unicorn. Two amazingly amazing shows together. College has really taken its toll on Elijah, he's going great. Oh, for God's sake! Stop it! A stroke Bumble? That's not his real name, it's Elijah. Bumble. Hello. Whoa. Endless, and I mean endless, Doctor Who references. Do not watch this. If you do, you will sleep no more. My shelf. <gasps> it's amazing. What? Third Doctor's Sonic Screwdriver. Fourth Doctor's Sonic Screwdriver. And future temps that River Song owns. That's all this stuff, you guys should have it if you're human because it's amazing. <laughs> One meal cooked and shared together. 
oodles of noodles shared. Elijah. <laughs> Zero arguments and infinite secrets kept. Oh, and of course, countless memories which will lead into many more. I know what you're thinking. What makes this duo so great? And that's just it. They are what makes it great. The two have brought out the absolute best in each other and knowing this, they now go through life together or not at all. You know when sometimes you meet someone so beautiful and then you actually talk to them and five minutes later they're as dull as a brick. And then there's other people. When you meet them you think, not bad, they're okay. And then you get to know them and their face just sort of becomes them. Like their personality's written all over it and they just turn into something so beautiful. Elijah's the most beautiful man I've ever met. Weird and wonderful. That is a key basis of the duo's friendship. So what if they're a little weird? Okay, a lot weird. But so what? If that's what keeps them happy, then let them be. If they want to wear masks... The in the city. What are you doing? You gotta stop the Joker. Stop the Joker! Where are they? I don't know where it all depends. You mean that silver? Watch Star Trek. Sing Lemonade Mouth. Quote Doctor Who, eat pizza, overuse Snapchat filters. <laughs> Wear matching clothes, pretend they're Troy and Gabriella. Wear onesies. Okay, maybe that one is just Renee, but still dress up a little sometimes, or just want to be completely, completely silly. As long as they're happy, which I'm quite certain they are, then leave them to be awesome and weird and wonderful. You see, when you meet someone and you just instantly click, hold on to that person. Because like Elijah and Renee, you might just have found your best friend in the whole universe. And I know you're wondering, how their best friendship can be so certain with only 436 days to it. Well, to be honest, nothing really is certain in this wacky world, but when you make a promise to someone, someone who really matters, you make it your duty never to break it. And that's the promise the two made, and it's a promise that will be kept forever. Always best friends, always together, always awesome.